Greetings, Boogie fans! Michael here, and welcome to the finale of my attempt to beat Pokemon Ultra Moon without catching any Pokemon. First, let's do a quick team overview because it's changed a bit since the last episode. First is Fabio, my starter Primarina, followed by Hazmat, the totem Salazzle, then Cray Cray, the revived fossil Cray Dilly, and then we've got Mace, the totem Togenomaru. And then the last two members are very exciting. We have Libre, the Halucha. I finally got a Pokemon from Pokey Pelago. Please let it be there. Please let it have stayed. Yes! Yes! Oh my god! And then lastly, I did decide to make the Eevee a Umbreon and swap out for the Totem Alolan Raticate. Wait, what? Oh, I don't remember these things. Oh, I'm fighting them, okay. You still just have a poi pole? You really built this up like this was gonna be a big deal and it's a poi pole. No, no, why you got a hyper, I was so close. Ugh. Well, turns out I actually did need two Pokemon to beat the poi pole, so it's a little embarrassing. All right, it's time for the final trial. Wait, no. No, never mind. There's another one in this game. One Pokemon down. And two Pokemon down. All right. Time for the Totem Kamalo. Big boy. It's taunting me with the fact that I couldn't get one of myself before the league because I put the last Totem sticker at the battle tree. I feel like this thing protects the first turn, but just in case it doesn't, Moonblast is the... Oh, it just outspeeds me and poison jabs me. Okay. Well, we live this and we kill it now. Oh, we have what? I'm gonna switch to Hazmat, cause I need someone to sack off so I can heal Primarina. Oh, that's actually quite annoying. All right, Hazmat goes down, that's fine. Now I'm bringing in Libre. Oh no, it's faster, what? Live, live, yes, yes! Let's go, no! Are you kidding me? Well, now I just gotta let it go down. My God, I thought I was gonna just crush this, but I am being humbled today. All right, Fabio, I need you to live two hits. Was that a crit? Are you kidding me? Wait, I outspeed the scissor, it's fine. Okay, the combo is down. That does, why do you keep critting me? All right, this won't KO because of the light screen, but it should do a good chunk. There goes the slowly moving ball of water. Oh! Wow! Sweet! Way to go, Fabio! That was incredible! Look at me, getting my stair steps in. This kid's gonna have ripped legs by the end of this playthrough. All right, here it goes. Me and Lily are somehow going to play these ancient instruments, despite the fact we've had no previous musical training and have no idea how we could possibly know the proper song to play. But it still works! And would you look at that, the little Cosmoum. Yay, now it's a dream catcher bat. Mahina pee. Whatever that means. Aha! It is I, Gurunty boy! And there he is. I knew you would show up here as soon as I brought my Cove Commuter 2 to the office. Give it to me by the sponsor of this video, Cove. What? Why did you know I would show up when you- I know you want, and have in fact tried to steal it from me. Which, to be honest, I understand. It is an incredible wireless speaker. The Cove Commuter 2 has excellent sound quality, seven hours of battery life, an impressive max volume, water resistance, and a 30 foot range. I use it all the time when in the shower, doing work around the house, or sometimes taking calls since it has a built-in microphone. And I'm sure you'd just love to take it from me. So you can use it to listen to Whatever it is you listen to when committing crimes. Oh, it's the Team Rocket hideout music. Yeah, yeah, of course it is. You sick, evil. Wait, why do you have one? I bought it. You bought something? Yeah. I mean, I did get 67% off by using code MJP67 at the link in the description below. So I didn't pay much, but I did buy it and it's great. I really like being able to split it into two different speakers. It's like two speakers for the price of one. You, grunty boy, 
paid for something and didn't steal it? Who are you? Same old me just trying to turn over a new leaf. Really? Nope. I took the money from your wallet while you were brand dealing. Ta-ta! Oh, come on! Ugh. Anyways, thanks so much to Ko for sponsoring. But now, back to the video. What is this? Guzma getting dropped? <laughs> I haven't seen this cutscene in years. Oh! She lands right on top of her. She dead. She's so dead. And there's our boy. Hungry for delicious photons. Oh, she's not dead. Run away. Good God. The stupid main character's face still just smiling like an absolute buffoon. Why didn't they give me facial expressions? I look ridiculous. <laughs> Lunala about to get got. Oh wait, this is cool. Oh, I forgot about this cutscene. Oh, yep, and it lost. Oh boy. Look at them hands. Oh, what? Whoa! Uh -huh. Oh look! Necrozma dropped a building on them. Oh, Olivia and a Feromosa. Nanu and a, oh, Nanu is in deep trouble. That thing eats everything. And there's a Zerka tree that Hapu's dealing with. Well, now it's my turn. Good thing I remembered this part and led with my dark type. Cause this thing is four times weak to dark, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure it's the same typing as Lunala. And now we pay back. Take this. All right, look at all that damage that my Umbreon did. That's pretty nice. Umbreon normally does not do very much damage. Well, that was easy. It's sinking like the Titanic. Yep, um, it's coming back to me now. It stole back the light. Everywhere is dark. If you hope to follow after Necrozma, you must make for the white warp hole. If you any other warp hole, you'll find yourself in another world altogether. Well, that makes sense. I am so not ready for this because I need to construct my team in such a way to take on Ultra Necrozma. So uh, I'm gonna talk to you guys later once I do all that. All right, this is my Ultra Necrozma team. I'll go back to the team I had before after the battle, but I have constructed a team perfectly designed to defeat Ultra Necrozma. By perfectly, I mean I'm doing the best I can. First, we have Mace with Sturdy, meaning it's guaranteed to live at least one hit, which allows me to fire back and get a nuzzle off, paralyzing Ultra Necrozma. We have Fabio with a Quick Claw, which probably isn't gonna activate and it's just gonna die, but if it does activate, Moonblast is gonna do a lot. Cray cray. Honestly, it's very unlikely to do anything here. Chipmunk is back with Sucker Punch, which allows it to guarantee to outspeed and hit Ultra Necrozma, because Ultra Necrozma only knows attacking moves. Enigma is here who I hope will survive an Ultra Necrozma attack and then fire back with a double power payback. And then Light Slayer, the totem Mimikyu, who really unfortunately has an attack lowering nature, but it has Ghost EMZ and Shadow Claw, so it's guaranteed to live at least one hit thanks to Disguise, and I can get some big damage, probably not Okoing, with Ghost EMZ. Now, I don't think any one of these Pokemon is gonna beat Ultra Necrozma on its own, but I think the combination of them will be good enough. Now I just have to physically get there. Well, uh, this is terrible. Might as well see what this is and uh, kill it for some experience points, I guess. Oh, what? No! Are you kidding me? I can't catch it! Oh, come on! Oh, <laughs> oh man. Oh, no, no. <laughs> I can't throw Pokeballs at it. Oh, and there it goes. Oh, that sucks. And all the playthroughs, it had to be the no catching one that I find a freaking shiny. Oh, huh. Oh, I finally found a white wormhole. I'm prepared this time. I know what's coming, but still, I haven't done this since the game came out and I am nervous. Oh, thing cut out from his head. Oh God. All right, Necrozma, take this. All right, Nuzzle. All right, did nothing, but Paralyzadade. I am faster. Wow, okay, five times, and it's fully paralyzed. Mace goes down, but 
Man, got more hits in than I thought it was going to, so that's dope. And since I think I outspeed now because I got the paralysis off, I'm gonna Super Fang to just, I know Super Fang will do half of the remaining HP. I don't know if Super Sucker Punch will do that much. Oh no, 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 I didn't, oh, oh. Oh, I thought I was gonna be faster. Okay, all right, well. All right, come on, Enigma, you can survive this. You can survive this, I know you can, you're bulky. Yes, payback is a Baneary. God, that did so little. All right, well, I'm gonna hope it's fully paralyzed and lower its defense. Dang it. All right, Light Slayer, you're my last hope. Never ending nightmare. I don't know how much this is gonna do. I have an attack lowering nature, but it's super effective in a Z move. No! Oh, if I had sucker punched. Yeah, I still have Fabio, but if it's not fully paralyzed enough times for me to get a hit off, I lose. Come on, come on. No! Maybe I'll live the hit? That was naive. All right, I know I have Cray Cray, but Fabio is genuinely my last hope. I have the Quick Claw, and it could be fully paralyzed. But if neither of those work on this turn, I lose. Come on, Fabio. Come on, Fabio! No! Oh! Oh! Fabio! Let's go! That was incredible! <laughs> that was dope! <laughs> oh, that's right, I can get a poi pole. I don't think I'm actually gonna use it, to be honest. Cool, all right, I believe this is the last Pokemon I get in this playthrough. Elima Bean, it's time for my revenge. Dunzo Funzo, take that, Elima. My revenge is finished. As you stand there trying to poop, I don't know. Lana? is my next fight. Oh man, ooh, wow. Why is this Araquanid so ripped? Maybe because it's extremely cool. <laughs> Who doesn't love an Araquanid? The answer is no one. Oh, I'm battling Nanu instead? Got him. That looks like a very weird, partially unpeeled banana. All right, that was the last thing. Okay, now I fight the Totem Rabombi finally. It's beautiful. We're just fighting it in her house. Hello. Its stats rose sharply. Which stats? Mmm. Oh, I forgot it could do that. That did so little. Okay, I resist this. Oh no. But this is not a very good situation, I must say. This Rabambi wants to kill me very badly. All right, all right, all right. This should be a dead Pelipper. Thank God. So I've gotten it to 1v1. I have to paralyze it. But maybe this will make it... Why didn't it paralyze it? Why didn't it paralyze it? It has shield dust. No! Oh, I might lose. Mm, I think it just outspeeds and outcoes my entire team. Wait, 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 I lived, I lived! Mace! Let's go! Wow, that did less than I thought it would. I am genuinely shocked. <laughs> All right, time to go do my final kahuna battle. All right, Hapu, I am ready to defeat you with my Pokemon that I did not catch. Let's do this. Oh, she's so small, but looks kind of terrifying when she does her eyes like that. Seed bomb. Oh, man. Oh, no! Well, I lived. Cray Cray, you did great. Is that Mudsdale's angry face? He just looks sleepy. Oh, 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 sorry, Cray Cray. Sorry, buddy. Yikes, yikes, yikety yikes. Excellent work, Libre! The final kahuna is defeated, incredible! All right, now that I've completed all of the trials and grand trials, one task left, to climb Mount Lanakila. Oh yeah, Gladian. Well, we're gonna beat him first. I feel like Lucario is too small. That's not relevant, I'm just I'm just talking. No, it's gonna be the grass one, because I started with Primarina. Yeah, look at me remembering things. I will sludge bomb you, or flamethrower you. What? What? Oh, I 
always forget about the freaking Zora War. Yeah, look at me remembering things. Bye, Hazmat. I jump kick and don't miss. I didn't miss, let's go. Oh, it's faster too? Libre, I thought you were fast, man. Girl, whatever. His four Pokemon defeated with my three. Okay, now I can actually start going at Mount Lanakila. Oh yeah, wait. This is where, <gasps> that's where Necrozma is. And I'm just gonna walk right by it and ignore it cause I'm not allowed to catch it. Ha <laughs> ha, look at me, I'm a genius. And here we are. The top of Mount Lanakila. All right. I'm approaching the Pokemon League. My Pokeball is shaking wildly. <gasps> Fabio! Are you ready for this, Fabio? Hail, yeah, you are. All right, in we go. Melane, you're going down first. There's the clef key. Cool, I'm leading with Salazzle. So I should be able to just flamethrower this thing away. Oh, freaking prankster. Oh, I burned it. All right, wow, way to go. Doug Trio. That's a Lolan Doug Trio. I'm switching to Libre because we're paralyzed and one ground move from that thing will knock Salazzle into the next dimension. Oh, he's just going for it right now. Oh, goody. Oh, boy. Oh, golly gee. I think this might just KO. Oh, Libre lived! Oh, my God! That was crazy! I mean, a crit kills. Oh, oh, the burn! Is this gonna be enough? Oh, come on, are you kidding me? And he gets fully paralyzed. <laughs> oh, but the burn KOs it, duh. Oh, I'm an idiot. I can't believe I forgot about clear body. Oh, and I missed my chance for payback to double because now it's slower. Oh my God, oh, that didn't even do anything. Wow, did I just live on one? Please let this Oko. If it doesn't, I'm dead. Yes! Oh, fantastic! And it's over. Way to go, Hazmat. Hazmat did incredible this battle. All right, Olivia, you're next. This is probably gonna be a two hit KO. Okay, two hit KO. Didn't flinch it. Oh, she got rocks up. Ugh. Sandstorm. Well, way to make this battle just freaking annoying. We landed it. Okay, all right, Probo passes down. Why did that do so much less? I don't understand. Oh, because of the special defense boost from the Sandstorm. All right, we land the high jump kick, we kill it. Booyah. Sandstorm's gone, that's nice. Never mind. This also has Sandstream. Halucha goes down, that's fine. I didn't give Grassium Z to Cray Cray either. What am I doing? All right, even if it KOs Cray Cray, it's used up its Z move on this. Oh, way to go, Cray Cray! He took that so well! All right, she might heal here. Oh, but Quick Claw activates! Oh, Cray Cray gets the win! <laughs> way to go, Cray Cray, that's fantastic. All right, next is Acerola, which is the battle of the Elite Four that I'm honestly the most concerned for. All right, you small child. Ah, oh, Screech missed! Okay, I would have rather it Shadow Clawed me, but that's fine. Oh, the Screech was enough, nice, nice. Oh no, not conf- <sighs> Fight through, Mace, fight through! Yes, yes! Excellent! Oh, she's bringing in her Palisand. I can just Oko it with Oceanic Operetta. I'm faster! It blows up and it Okos! A deal, Mize. Oh no, it didn't Oko! If we live this though, we're good, because she'll heal and we just outspeed it and hit it twice. Yep, okay, we're good. Oh, almost got it in that one. Okay, all right, she's really making me go through the motions of this, isn't she? All right, finally. Got him! Oh, I crit it too! I wonder if that mattered. All right, well, I was really worried about that, but that's the only one so far where not a single Pokemon has fainted. Cool. All right, the final Elite Four member. Kahili, the girl I accidentally called Khaleesi on a regular basis. Didn't KO, but did I? I got the flinch! Let's go! Oh, she didn't heal. It's a little odd. Mandibuzz. Oh, this might kind of hurt. Fabio, you legend! 
Oh, so close. All right, well, she's gonna heal this turn, so so am I. Flatter, doesn't that boost my special attack? It does. If Fabio goes down, then Fabio absorbed it for us and we'll say thank you. I like how it's flying, it's just it's still standing. <laughs> ah! Okay, well, that's fine. Mace will get it back. It's a laser lance of shocking power. Booyah! What does that do? Ooh! Cray Cray, you just gotta land, you just gotta land one rock slide. Okay, well now it's two times super effective instead of three. Oh, and it was still enough! <laughs> instead of four, whatever. All right, the Elite Four done. Just one battle left. All right, there he is. There's how. A little nervous, but I believe in my team! I'm immediately paybacking because I feel like this thing can hit me really hard. Oh, it missed! Wow, what? Who? Halucha, I thought you were faster! Mace can tank the hit and paralyze it. God, this thing hits like a truck! No, it knows Earthquake! Oh, crap. This is a giant problem. What is this Tauros's speed? And hope payback does a lot. Okay, double edge recoil. Oh, it crit me, because of course it did. But wait, now payback should kill. No, are you kidding me? What is this Tauros? Okay, all right, I here's what I do. I heal Libre. He's withdrawing? Okay, so this thing's obviously going for a fighting move. It didn't. What is this team? He's crushing me. I have to brick break, because if he doesn't heal here, then I'm just dead. Okay, he didn't heal. Thank God I didn't swords dance. There's the Tauros. Okay, we keep battling. I just have to live the double edge. Or he does that. Okay, if he goes for double edge again, the recoil plus brick break will kill. Oh my God, the Tauros was insane. Noivern, I'm switching. Yes, I know exactly who can handle this. Just don't flinch me. Just don't flinch me. I know I can take the damage. Okay, well, that's fine. Just don't flinch me. There we go, now you're dead. All right, cool. I can bring in Cray Cray to tank a hit or two while I heal up Palucha. How much does poison damage do this turn? I flinched it. I think he full restores this turn. So this is where I switched to Libre. Okay, that's what I expected. So now he acrobatics. Oh, it just Leaf Blade. Why is it faster than me? What is going on with the speed in this game? How fast are all these Pokemon? Okay, it's down. The last Pokemon is Incineroar. He might go for the Z move here. No, it just goes for Earthquake. That does less than half. Oceanic Operetta. Oh, I am faster. <laughs> this should end it right here. Here it goes. The slow moving orb of water. Engulfing the fire type. And blowing up. Incineroar is down! Which means I have beat Pokemon Ultra Moon without catching a single Pokemon. I need to see my team in the Hall of Fame. Let's go, let's get through this talking nonsense. Enigma, oh, the little Eevee. Egg from the daycare. Libre, my only Pokepelago Pokemon. Oh, maybe there's another one I just didn't use, that's right. Mace, the Totem Togedemaru. Fabio, my glorious starter, has met the Totem Salazzle, and Cray Cray Dilly. Ooh, let's let us, let's spin for a second. Look at the team. Thank you guys so much for watching this series. There's more videos to come. Make sure you subscribe, click somewhere on the screen, and that is all I have for now. So until next time, big fans, gotta catch them all.